share and even leave a comment if you know more information about the topic for today but what i'm talking about for today is what is vitamin u a lot of people looking like what is vitamin u you know you got the information right here and if you have anything to add on you know let me know i'm gonna read off what is vitamin u you know well, vitamin U is also known as S-methylmethionine. Now, S-methylmethionine, you know, is also short to just SMM. And you know that's another name for vitamin U. Now, our body, it doesn't produce vitamin U. And we have to consume to get it, you know? And I know you're looking like, where can we consume to get it? And it's found in mainly cabbage juice. And that's where it's mainly found in. And also plants grown in warmer countries that contain higher amount of vitamin U inside the plants, you know? And other ways to consume it. Now I'm about to read off all the plants and vegetables that contain vitamin U and it's a long list so bear with me. Now the foods containing vitamin U is carrots, turnips, potatoes, beetroots, asparagus, onions, broccoli, celery, parsley, and we know cabbage, kale, Brussels sprouts, and it's also in some cosmetics out there, which is, you know, some new information to take in. Now, I'm going to read off the health benefits of vitamin U. Vitamin U is said to help protect gastrointestinal line, which is very good to keep in mind. It's also said to help aid recovery of gastrointestinal line during inflammation. And that's important to keep in mind as well, you know. Don't want your gastrointestinal line and acting up, you know. It's important to get that charge in and do your daily routine. It's also said to help alleviate pain, which is very good, you know? Especially going day to day, you know, working hard. Like, hey, take a look at vitamin U and see how it works. It's also said to help normalize acid levels in your stomach, which is very good, keep in mind. And once it help normalize the acid levels in your stomach, It'll help your digestion, which is very good. It's also said to fight symptoms like hay fever. Now, if you don't know what hay fever is, now hay fever is also known as allergic rhinitis. And what it is, is it have you feeling awful. It's an allergic reaction that causes sneezing, congestion, itchy nose or throat and even more so you know if this said to help fight against hay fever you know take a look at vitamin u and see how it's going on even vitamin u looking like hey you know take a look at me and see how it's going on you know even he's happy which is very good <laughs> Now, 
It may help your skin to recover faster. You know, have a wound or something like, hey, take a look at it. vitamin U and see how it works. It's also said to help improve your liver function, which is very good. You know, you only got one liver, so take a look at vitamin U and see how it works. It's also said to have antihistamine properties. Now, if you don't know what histamine is, histamine is a chemical created by the immune system that reacts from allergens like pollen, dust, and even more, which causes sneezing, coughing, and more, which is not good. Now, if it have antihistamine properties, Antihistamine, if you don't know what that is, it's our medication that helps with allergies, stomach problems, cold, anxiety, and even more. So keep that in mind as well, you know. So take a look at vitamin U and see how it works. Even vitamin U looking like something that's good, you know. It's also said to have anti-allergenic properties as well, which is very good to keep in mind. It's also said to help fight stomach ulcers and different types of ulcers. Now, if you don't know what ulcer is, ulcer is a sore on the skin or mucous membrane with loss of surface tissue, which is not good. And keep that in mind as well, you know? It's also said that it may help fight and treat gastritis. Now, if you don't know what gastritis is, gastritis is also known as dyspepsia, which is the inflammation of the lining of the stomach and it can occur suddenly so you know you don't want that to happen so take a look at vitamin U and see what, how it works I know it's a lot of information on vitamin U also said to help fight against food allergies which is very good keep in mind also said to help fight against liver problems. And it may help treat bronchial asthma issues as well, which is very important to keep in mind. Also said to help protect your body from infections, which is good, you know? Very important to keep yourself good, it's only one of you. It's also said to help boost the immune system, which is very good to keep in mind. Said that it may help with depression. If you have depression issues, you know, they can look at vitamin U and see how it works. Also said to help lower cholesterol and may protect your lungs and your kidneys, which is very good, you know. It's also said to help lower triglycerides. Now, you wanna know triglycerides mean? Triglycerides is a type of fat found in your blood. So you know, lose extra fat, fat in your blood, you know, take a look at vitamin U and see how it works. No wonder he's at I'm looking like, oh, okay. <laughs> now, you know what vitamin U is. And remember, keep this in mind, spread the news, spread the word about congredimens. I really hope that this information is helping you, you know, know what to consume. There's only one of you. And remember, don't overconsume or underconsume whatever you consume, no matter what you consume. And keep that in mind as well. I love all y'all out there that's watching. Like, subscribe, share. Stay tuned for more future videos because you never know what might come next. And you know, stay tuned to see more future videos. 
And to reach me is kimgreetings at gmail.com. And I love all y'all just watching. Stay tuned for more future videos. See y'all in the next future video. I can't find that